Card Man here, Mad Card Minister, back with another video. Legendary Creatures, perfect for a commander. Grun, the Lonely King, an ape warrior. If Grun was kicked when he enters the battlefield, put 5 1 1 counters on him. If he attacks alone, double his power and toughness so essentially he could be a 2020 up next now has a has have a has a I can't even fucking pronounce it has observed a habit you can redirect damage to him 2-5, Summon Legend, Hebazur to Abbott from Homelands, redirect damage to him, and the motherfucker dies. <clears throat> Tobias Andrion, no abilities, just flavor text, three of any color to cast them, one white. One blue, four four. This guy don't really do anything. I would try to put a bunch of equipment on him if he was my commander. Every turn when he was out, he'd get a different equipment on him or something. Koro Pitlord, legendary demon spirit, rare. Nine mana to put out mono black. Every turn you gotta pay four mana, black or or sacrifice them. Pay one life, target creature gets minus one minus one till end of turn. Nine nine. I don't like this card. Kuro Pit Lord. Slim Voda, Sling Va Sling Vada. The Rising Deep, Slim Voda, 8-8, eight, eight. Kicker. This card is good for Merfolk, Krakens, Leviathans, Octopuses, Serpents, all the cards nobody ever uses. It looks like he's got a giant city on his back. He got like a giant, a giant city or something on his back. A bunch of Merfolk live on his back, a bunch of mermaids and shit be living all over him. Tor Wookie, Tor Wukai, Tar Waki, Tar Tor Waki. Tap him and he deals two damage to target attacking or blocking creature. Kind of a shitty card. Who'd want this guy as a commander? Anax and Simide. Annex and Siamid, I mean. Some of these cards are hard to pronounce. Looks like Leonidas from the 300. Legendary creature, human soldier. Three mana. One of any color. One red, one white. First strike, vigilance. This could be good as a human soldier commander. If you were going tribal soldiers, you could think about using this one at least. Mowu, Mowu Loyal Companion. Legendary Hound, 3-3. Three, three. If one or more plus one plus counters will be put on Mowu, that many plus one plus one counters plus one are put on him. So if you put, so if he becomes a 4-4 four, four because you put a plus one plus one counter on him, really he becomes a 5-5. Five, five. A little confusing. Marhat, Marhalat, Marholt, Elves Dragon, Rampage, this fucking guy could go on a Rampage, 4-6, 
kind of an old card. M Marik, Mariki, Riburi. I can't even fucking pronounce this. Morocco Burico does not untap during your untap phase. This is a good card though. So you tap this card, you gain control of one of your creatures' cards or one of your opponent's cards. Excuse me. You tap this. You pick one of your opponent's creatures, and as long as this card stays tapped, you get to have their creature. That simple. Mariki Ribaridi. Couple special cards in the background I'm about to show you. Your boy Vader, your motherfucking boy. Tap to destroy a creature. M. Bison, legendary Street Fighter. 4-4. Four, four. Tap to look at the cards in your opponent's hand. Flying Vigilance, first strike. The Goku, <coughs> Goku Super Saiyan, Planeswalker, an exile target creature. Foil, your boy Clark Kent, legendary Kryptonian 8-8, flying first strike, indestructible, foil, And last on the list, Mortal Kombat Scorpion with the get over here game mechanic. Tap a red and a black, gain control of target creature and opponent controls and it has haste. Zombie, Ninja, Spirit, Tribal Commander. The last four cards at the end of the video could be obtained by a link in the description. Cardman, Mad Card Minister. See you next time.